I'm Lauren and I am the engineer. I absolutely feel like I'm walking into a life-size dollhouse. This place is unbelievable. My girlfriend Lauren in that dress happens. He should be making his entrance. What do you do? I am exploring that. Oh. <laughs> How did you create this? I mean, just a little something. I'm an engineer, so I create okay. things with all sorts, in oh. style, of course. You made that booty? I made this booty. That's what Alex is writing about. That this is the muse. Oh. This is the muse. And this guy, we just met this guy. He's here. Do you think he was just reading about himself before he came down no. here? This is super cryptic, like cryptic AF. So we're like, okay, we took the book down with us to show everyone just to like bring the evidence down to the group. Okay, so this bookmark says evil on one side <laughs> and live on the other. <gasps> that and sounds live. like an Eminem lyric. Evil. evil? We got it. Ah! That's what it is. It has to be evil. Or live. Right. Try live or eat to me tonight, okay? And then stabbed. So we have to get ice? Salt. You know what? Salt. Salt. Oh, <laughs> Allison rings the bell, just like alarms us that vampires are on their way, but my dress is just so big and voluptuous. Why? Hi. How did you get hi, out? Hi, hi, hi. Oh my gosh. What happened? Oh my hi. It's good You're to okay? see you. Yeah, Hello. I'm Here, let me help. Joey and Liza untie Andrea and I from the poles, and we are free. Joey killed a vampire. Killed you a vampire. killed a vampire? Killed a vampire? Yeah. Yes. Okay, what do we do now? Still wondering where Alex is. He's supposed to be my knight in shining armor, but he is nowhere to be found. I think she also meant that she's being held here. Who, who is this she? Allison. His daughter. His daughter. I already don't trust her. Really? Mm -hmm. If you saw what the vampires did to me, you would not ever trust the vampires. They were eating him. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. <laughs> when Joey, Andrea, Liza, and Lauren return, my focus is on Lauren. My girlfriend is back, and I'm not letting her get taken again. This is beautiful. I mean, oh, yeah, Liza yeah. doesn't want to give up the journal to him because, like, okay, yeah, super shady. Why do you have the key already on your person? And he doesn't want to give the key up to Liza. Joey's name is randomly in the book, so we don't really know if he's hiding something or or what's happening with the journal. Okay, read the rest. Okay, read the rest. That requires the evil. The journal basically says we need put those two things together. Grab the two. Grab. If they answer incorrectly, the vampire is drained of all their blood. Being his daughter, I have the privilege of knowing the answer. Who would like to go in? I can. That's too much pressure. Do it for the team. I'll do it. I'm good at riddles. Are you sure you don't want to do it, Lauren? No, no, no. Not my Lauren. I feel like Joey put me in a really weird spot because I didn't want to do it because I wasn't confident enough, but then it kind of makes it look like I just don't want to be a team player. Your name was on the invitation, and we wouldn't be in this situation if it weren't for you. Oh, okay. can we Let me invite you? you to my party, and then all of a sudden, let me chain myself up and be all kinky and stuff. No, that's not me. It's me. I'm sweet. Do we know that's I'm a not sweet you? boy. Who, Who hasn't, hasn't done, done anything? anything. I'm sorry. Lauren has to go. She's right there. We've all risked something. Hi. So you'd like to kill me off? I don't want to kill anybody. We Lauren. just think that you okay. should fight for your life. That's it. I really feel like Lauren is the weakest in the group right now. Let's what leave this group. They're Lauren, obviously against you. you. I think you have a good heart. This is getting out of control. I think I'm being victimized. Just I've been cooperative, and I haven't done anything wrong, whereas Daystorm has had so many shady things happen to him, and I'm somehow put on the same level as you Daystorm. You didn't do anything wrong, but you didn't do anything right, and you had an opportunity to step up and help the team, and because you backed out. Because I didn't think I would be strong enough for the challenge and have someone on our team killed. Ooh. We didn't know what we were getting into. She what? gave us the answer. Then why didn't you volunteer? I did the salt. You did some stairs. good salting. Good uh, salting. Thank you. Everyone is pointing fingers. I came here to party, and this has turned into like a legitimate horror movie where people are getting killed. Okay, let her go through it. Okay. Voting is simple. One by one, you'll get the card for the person you'd like to vote into the challenge. Allison shuffles the cards, and I feel like my odds are pretty high because Joey really, really bad talked me to everybody. Lauren. The storm. Okay. If you two would follow me, everyone else can stay. It came down to me and Lauren. I was shocked. I thought the team knew that they needed me. So I walk into the ballroom, and I see all these damn vampires standing there, staring at me like I'm their next meal. Uh, like they don't have Postmates. Each one of you must unravel three clues to find the location of the Golden Goblet. Take your starting monies. And don't take too long. Otherwise, we'll have to kill you both. And wouldn't that be a shame? 
Begin. In the center of three celestial points, silver weights. Three celestial points. One, two. I'm looking for three stars, and it's taking me forever to find the third one. He got a star on his chest. I don't see no damn silver, though. You have a star. You got <gasps> silver? <gasps> you know, now that I'm really thinking about it, maybe Lauren's intention of not doing the challenge was because she didn't know if she was physically able to do it. Honestly, at the end of the day, Lauren's not, like, sketchy. She's not treating, like, talking down to us. This would have been a good conversation to have earlier. Hell no. Oh, I was afraid, but I'm not screaming. I honestly don't know if I can do the snakes. I hate snakes. I don't mess with snakes. <sighs> All right, I got some silver. The letter. I died in battle and need to pay the ferryman to carry me to my eternal rest. Can you please find my coffin, which is marked by the sign of my faith. Sign of my faith. OK, here's a cross. OK, I got one. Okay. All right, I found a damn coffin. Right. I grab the silver coin, and I'm following Daystorm's lead over to the next step. Is there a lock? What does this mean? I got to pick out the combination for this lock. What? Now, OK, so now I got to figure out this daggone equation. OK, I've got 3 times 5 is 15. Minus six equals nine. How did they get this? OK, so six times four is 24. 24 minus 10 make 14. Got it. Five times seven is 35. Minus five is 30. Five times seven, so that's seven. Seven times two is 14. Minus eight five is times... six. This is two. Five times what will make? This time I can't five. think. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to figure mine out. So two times nine is 18. 18 minus what equals 4? 14. Took a little while, but I said I'm gonna beat this girl. I solved the math problems, and I get the combination open. Holy shit. I gotta pay this mother. So then I feed this guy in his eyeballs. Yep, I fed him the coins in his eyeballs, gave him the silver, and then one of the vampires rewarded me with the third clue. Take my sword and slay the dragon who took my life? A dragon. Now, you, you think I'm making this up? There was a damn dragon in the ballroom. If y'all come over here, I'm going to slay your asses, too. Ah! I slayed the dragon. A drawer popped open under the dragon. I can't make this up. The golden goblet is beside the queen's throne. Present this to her. They said that the queen had the golden goblet. Chill, bro. So I give the letter to the queen. She goes into her little chest. Because I'm not dying. I'm going to get the golden goblet. And it's gold. <sighs> Add that to my collection. I'm sorry, girl, but I got this golden goblet. I just, I, like, my brain cannot process the fact that I was here for a dinner party and ended up about to be eaten by vampires. I ain't dying today. Right, now that we've got that finally over and done with, can we please kill the other one? Yeah, kill her! Kill her! 